and ready. All right, I'm here with Austin Kim at the LPGA Drive-On Championship. A solid round to start your uh, LPGA 2024 season here. Uh, can you just walk us through your round and maybe some of those highlights you had out there? Yeah, um, I had five birdies today and a double. The double is a bit unfortunate. I skied my three wood, landed uh, in a bunker with a fried egg, just a couple of bad shots in a row. But uh, as soon as I got my ball into the green and I made my putt, I, I wasn't worried. I kind of laughed it off with my caddy. and. I knew that it was just an unlucky break and just one bad shot. I uh, kept going and the putts dropped in the second half of the round. How did, I mean, how do you mentally recover for something like that? I know <laughs> yeah. it's it probably laughable at that point, I think. Yeah, um, I just accepted the fact that I hit a bad shot. Bad shots will happen. I told myself that this morning before I started the round, the bad shots will happen. I unfortunately skied a couple today. But uh, I managed to regroup and adjust and uh, felt really good after that. I knew uh, I got a couple of bad shots out of the way, so that was oddly calming in a way. And um, I just kept taking it one shot at a time. I laughed the mistakes yeah. off, and I felt really good. That is strong, too. Birdie, birdie on those last two holes. Just walk us through those two holes out there. I know part five, part three. Yeah, on uh, my second to last hole, I hit a really solid drive. I had about 215 in. Um, nice little two putt there from about, uh, I can't remember exactly, about 18 yards uh, first putt and then uh, two footer tap in. And then on the last hole, I hit a really good tee shot to about 15 feet and sank the putt. It was great. What were you seeing on the greens that were, was really kind of clicking with your eye? I mean, I know these are really super undulating, classic Donald Ross, but what were you seeing that really helped to drop right. some putts? I think when I was preparing for the week, I really uh, emphasized specific portion, portions of the green that I had to land on. So I separated each green based on where the pins w could potentially be. And uh, I just wanted to leave myself in the best spots possible. Uh, I knew that I wasn't going to hit them super close, but if I happened to get one close, great. And I'd be leaving myself like 15, 20, 30 footers. And uh, if I could roll a few in, then that would be great. How cool is it to have Sarah on your bag? I mean, obviously, has been out here, done all of this with Elena um, mm -hmm. throughout the years. But for you, is to have a veteran caddy like that, how much does that help you in this first round? Yeah, the experience is really important. But also, when I started out the round today, she was really calm, and that affected me in a great way. And after I made double, I just kind of looked at her and smiled, and she smiled back, so it was really funny. Uh, helped me get over that a little bit better. I wasn't really angry to begin with, but it was nice having someone who really believes in me, too, and uh, can smile back in moments like in moments like those. Last one for me. What's the secret to your just, like, calm, cool, collectedness? You just seem really chill. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's not natural. It's a lot of it's a lot of work, but also um, a lot of good internal dialogue with myself, keeping myself calm, acknowledging what's happening, and accepting the fact uh, if a bad shot happens, like I know that I want to be the best that I can, and if a bad shot happens, it's totally okay. Uh, it's up to the next one, and I know that's a bit of a cliche, but it really works, and uh, I feel like I got a really good thing going. And then I was just going to ask about your first tee shot, too. How, how were you preparing for that? This time you have, you've obviously made an LPGA start before, but right. this time you have your card, you have a full rookie season ahead of you. Uh -huh. What were kind of the emotions going through your mind as you were going to tee off and yeah. just like preparing for that, too, as well? I'd be lying if I said I wasn't thinking about it last night, but um, it's just like any other shot that I've hit. I've hit millions of tee shots. I've hit uh, thousands of first tee shots, so... I just tried to rely on my experience. I definitely was nervous, but it wasn't as bad as uh, Pelican. And uh, I hit it a little high, but it got the job done. So I'm Awesome. Happy. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Great. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Keep it rolling. Thank you, guys.